and developing this morning. A young man dies shielding the woman he loves from a would-be carjacker. CBS 2's V. Wynn joins us live from Logan Square, where police say the attacker came out of nowhere with a gun. V. Mike and Aaron, police are reviewing surveillance cameras to see if they can identify the sh shooter and the getaway car. Police say the victim was shot multiple times during a fight with the suspect. Chicago police returned to the crime scene to continue their investigation to find the person who shot and killed Alexis Andrade. Daniela Roca is his girlfriend's sister. He was amazing. He was great. He was sweet, nice. The 22 year old was sitting in the car and listening to music with his 21 year old girlfriend when they were confronted by a man with a gun. My sister called my dad, and then my sister started crying that um, her boyfriend got shot. The attempted carjacking happened late Sunday night near Barry and Allen, right across the street from his girlfriend's house. My sister's boy, boyfriend didn't give it to her, him. And then um, he stepped out, and then they stuck. He went aside, and then, because I think he was trying to protect my sister, and then they started fighting. He didn't know he got a, like, a gun. Police got to the scene and found the victim on the ground, shot in the arm, chest, and forehead. He was taken to Illinois Masonic Hospital where he died. Police spent hours at the scene looking for possible evidence in the bushes as family watched in disbelief. Andrade's girlfriend was not physically hurt. Family says the two dated for years. See, oh, it's, oh my God, he's the one. I love him. I'm sad. It's like she loved him so much. Now, Chicago police only have a vague description of the suspect. He's believed to be set between 17 to 24 years old, 5'10", around 130 pounds. Police say he got away in a dark colored van with tinted windows. Reporting live from the city's northwest side, V. Wynn, CBS 2 News.